going on everyone welcome back I want to make a very quick follow-up video to my advanced cooking and sons of the forest from yesterday you guys have proven once again that you're smarter than the idiot that makes these guides someone named V pointed out something in the comments that I completely missed notably the buffs on the left in a previous episode this is one of the few that stand out and it's not for a good reason this recipe is garbage all you get is an eighth of your hunger filled and an eighth of your hydration filled. It's terrible. The lumberjack juice is another more expensive one. Now this one's disappointing because for how expensive that is, especially the med. I want to point out one or two things that I think I forgot to mention as well as revise a few statements on specifically eggnog and lumberjack juice. Or do I? cook anything in the game, you have to fill the pot up with water. But you can also put it away. And then bring it back out. And you can actually drink out of this, meaning now you actually have double flasks. You get four sips and it does the same amount of hydration as the flask does. The first recipe I want to point out from yesterday that I missed something on is liquid battery. Now I missed a buff on the left that you'll notice now. And I don't think it really does anything, but if you notice the energy, this is actually stronger than energy drinks. So I've tried this on a bunch of trees. This is what it looks like before getting the lumberjack buff. Somewhere around nine swings. Okay, so now we'll eat the lumberjack juice, and you'll see the buff on the on the left. I didn't notice that, and I've tested this by taking one sip, two sips, three sips, or eating the entire thing. It doesn't seem to matter. There might be a duration difference, but I haven't noticed it. So with the lumberjack buff on, this is now what it looks like. It almost feels like you have console commands on. This is kind of OP, honestly. It's like three or four chops. So I'm sorry, End Knight. I'm a bad beta tester. Lumberjack juice approved. Now for eggnog, this is probably the one I was the most harsh on. Let's see if my mind can be changed. And if you look on the left, this is what the buff looks like. I found that it, it has done absolutely nothing. It's actually a debuff. And with the eggnog buff, which is supposed to be a cooking buff, uh, it, it doesn't decrease the amount of items that you need. It doesn't increase the effectiveness. It takes just as long. And you also get a new bug, like the one I'm looking at right now, where the pot will never stop cooking. The lid won't come off. The only way to get around this is to chop it apart. And now if I pick it up, you'll see if I equip it, it has the eggnog. But it never would have stopped cooking. I hope this follow-up video was helpful for you. If you enjoyed it or learned anything, please like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Till the next one, I'll see you.